Big win for Ryan O'Neill. A Los Angeles court has decided that he is the owner of this multi-million dollar portrait of Farrah Fawcett, O'Neill's longtime but often a strange love. ABC's Nick Watt has the story. After deliberating for 12 hours, an L.A. jury just decided Ryan O'Neill can keep this Warhol portrait of his late love, Farrah Fawcett. The Lord helps those who help themselves. Apparently, he's going to give it to their only child, Redmond. It's a great Christmas gift, man, you know? The portrait, one of a pair, was painted by the pop art master in 1980. O'Neill claims Warhol gave one to him and one to Fawcett. But the University of Texas at Austin, of all places, took the love story star to court to fight for it. You see, Fawcett, a Charlie's angel and a keen painter, left her art collection to UT, her alma mater. They got one of the Warhols worth millions when she died in 2009, and then someone noticed the other one hanging above O'Neill's bed in Malibu on his reality show, Ryan and Tatum, The O'Neills. The university filed suit. The only artwork she wanted to go to the University of Texas was her artwork, which ironically is in the basement or some catacomb for the last three years. O'Neill was in court nearly four weeks, joined on occasion by his sons and one day by Fawcett's fellow Charlie's angel, Jacqueline Smith. I really feel Farrah would want that portrait with Ryan. And the jury agreed nine to three. We now need to take a good hard look at what we, where we go from here. For Good Morning America, Nick Watt, ABC News, Los Angeles.